Hi, I'm Amelia, and I'm a cheesemonger here in Brooklyn, New York. Today I'm going to show you how to use a rosa mat to create beautiful cheese flowers with Tete de Moine AOP. Tete de Moine is one of Switzerland's most iconic cheeses, with an 800-year history beginning at a single monastery in the Swiss Jura region. Today, Tete de Moine is made by fewer than 10 mountain dairies, with fresh raw milk from cows that graze on native grasses and herbs that give the cheese its signature fruity and nutty flavor. Directly translating to monk's head, Tete de Moine historically has been scraped into its signature rosettes using either a knife or a girole like this one, also known as a cheese curler. Scraping the cheese allows more of the surface to be exposed to oxygen, which allows the flavors to fully develop. The Rosamat combines Swiss cheese tradition with modern technology, making it quick and easy for every cheese counter to make and sell rosettes. The Rosamat is easy to set up and only a few steps. Make sure your Tete de Moine wheel is cold and do not cut or remove any part of the rind. After plugging in the Rosamat, place the bottom plate onto the machine so that it catches any debris. Firmly press the wheel of Tete de Moine onto the base piece, then press the bottom latches together to secure the cheese. Place the base piece onto the Rosamat and twist until you hear it fall into place. Next, secure the scraper piece on the spike and slowly lower it until it touches the top rind. To start the machine, simultaneously press the side button and press the scraper down against the cheese. Maintain strong, even pressure to keep removing the top rind until the paste is revealed. Discard that rind and you're ready to rock and roll. To make the rosettes, press on the scraper with your pointer and middle fingers and use your thumb to quickly tuck the cheese under itself in a circular motion. Remove your finger from the button and gently pull the flour off. It should split from the wheel cleanly at the scraper. Congratulations, you just made a rosette! Tete de Moine rosettes are best enjoyed fresh within one week, so make sure you're not making too many at one time and that you're merchandising them in an eye-catching way, such as packaging with a clear top. You can request these repack stickers directly from your distributor. When you're done making your rosettes, cleanup is a breeze. If you've only used part of your wheel of Tete de Moine, don't remove the cheese from the base. Just wrap the whole thing in plastic wrap and store it in your lowboy for the next time you need to make rosettes. All removable parts of the rosamat can be hand washed with soap and water, and the base of the machine can be wiped down with sanitizer. And that's how easy it is to use the rosamat to create fresh rosettes of Tete de Moine AOP. They're beautiful, simple, and delicious. Perfect for any cheese counter and ideal for catering, happy hour, picnics, cooking, or just an everyday snack. For more information about Tete de Moine, visit www.tetdemoine.ch. To inquire about getting a Rosa mat for your shop, visit www.shopjuicernet.com at the link on the screen. For more information on creating a rosette program at your store, email info at fullshelffoods.com, and to order the cheese, reach out to your local distributor.